Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Ranked Grind video. We're nearing 2k MMR for the first time this season in 2v2, I believe, and I'm starting to grind the game a bit more again, and I'm feeling that spark to go for top 10 in the leaderboards. Once you're in top 10, though, it gets pretty crazy high in MMR, so we'll see what we can do, but it's time to hop back into twos, and hopefully you guys can pick up something for your own gameplay. Win or loss, I just record the games in a row and see how the matches turn out, and I'll do my best to explain my thoughts as always, but let's see how these games go. Hope you guys enjoy. All right, we got LJ on my team against Bali and Sosa. I've seen Bali around quite a bit lately, actually, in ranked. He must have reached a little bit higher MMR to reach the team, uh, reach these games. Hopefully, LJ can stay with that while I get a boost. Just off the wall really hard. He's going to go for this, most likely. I'm just going to go for a 50-50. Go for the mid boost now. LJ should have this. Nice boom. So this is probably going to clear this across. I see that. So I'm going to get ready for the return. Over the one. Maybe I can bump him. Close. Try to go for the bump on the next player. That way uh, we could get a free opening. Just looking for boost pads in mid here. So LJ was going back. So I returned back to the back end. I'm going to go for the left side here. Nice. Oh, does he have again? What a shot. Nice. I just backed off once I saw him going up. Uh, it was way harder of a read for me because he was already up in the air for the first touch. But it's good of me to look for the left side there because it's behind Sosa. Um, which means we, we get a free uh, cutoff basically. I'm going to stay with the late 50-50 here. Makes it awkward. Good try. I'm gonna make sure. Okay, LJ has that boost so I'm just going to back off. LJ tried to keep it in but he actually popped it to the, uh, to the other team with that touch. Probably chip this pretty hard. Cleared the corner. It's all good. Sosa's in the corner here, but there's no boost, so he's probably going to turn in wide. Try to go for the demo off that, but good 50-50. Right there, I was trying to cover to make sure that in case the 50-50 went wide uh, over me, I could still uh, cover it. Nice demo. I had to be really careful there because he could have chipped that really high. Go for a high uh, air dribble over him. So a decent try for a dunk there from LJ, but I'm going to be in a 1v2 because of that. Bali ends up throwing it away though, so I'm just going to keep this close in the corner so it bounces nicely for LJ hopefully. Decides to play it patient. Could follow us up with the next touch. See if I can stay close to this. Make it awkward for his clear, get a bump too, LJ's going to get free space. So right now we're just using the space really well on the field. I did a video recently talking about space. Whoa. Watch out for the demos. Um, and just talking about how like... The touches that you make and the 50-50s that you go for should should keep the ball close to your team no matter which way it's won or lost. Like right here, keeping this close to the wall. So that way uh, LJ can beat him. I thought it was a free win, but it was close. It's not a great touch. going to pop to mid. LJ tried for it. If LJ, if uh, Sosa catches this early... Um, oh, he touched it. Um, I was going to say, if Sosa touches that early... Ooh. Should be okay. I'm getting caught up with LJ a lot here, but that's okay. I'm just going to stay back with 30 boost. Kind of expected Sosa to take his time and control that there, so I just went for the immediate challenge. It's a little bit risky, but uh, it's probably my best option rather than getting 1v2'd. Nice cut. I think LJ leaving that for me would have been better, though. That's an interesting touch. Sosa's going to go for this. I'm just going to fake this on the wall. Wait for the next boom. So I think Sosa's low boost because he did that. Because of the way that he caught it. It's a decent catch, too. Getting Bali's way. Good. I'll take this back. Over Bali. I fake this touch. Good try. Should be LJ's ball once again. That 50 50 being late like that is going to lead it back to my team. Uh, good 50 50 from Sosa. Get the bump. Wait for Bali to go in and challenge. Should be fast enough, and there we go. Do a little quick chip shot. I saw Sosa go for the corner, so I had a little bit more time on my lead up. And we get the free win there. Oh, not free win. I mean, just mean the, the forfeit. <laughs> it wasn't a free win at all. Well, he's actually pretty solid. Yeah, he, he seems to be uh, going up in points. Uh, I actually don't have my MMR on right now, but if I go to the Q menu, if I go to here, uh, I'm at 1981 now. At the beginning, I think it was 1974, so we got a few points. I'm going to turn that back on, actually. I turned it off uh, just because sometimes I actually find I play better when I don't see the MMR. Uh, especially with players I don't actually know. 
Uh, so if I do that, it's good for videos that I have it on so you can see uh, the points and if we win or lose. So it's actually really weird because I, I did turn off uh, MMR uh, when I was queuing just offline, like off of stream and uh, YouTube. Uh, I actually find that I do play quite a bit better a lot of the times um, when I don't see that. Especially, it's, more, it's more, more with like players I don't recognize, like Bali, for example. Like seeing that he's 1861 would make me think that he's like maybe not as solid as the other players, but he is pretty good. I have time here for the reverse clear. Try to keep that to my teammate. Yeah, I knew, I knew he was going to beat me there. I shouldn't have went. I don't know why I went. I, th I thought maybe there would be a little more time. There we go. Got some space here. Put that behind Sosa. So it was awkward. He must have a free ball now. Good touch. Could follow it up too. What a follow. Nice shot. Well played. Uh, my, my challenge there from Sosa. I should have expected him to have that because he was pretty high boost. So that could have been a lot worse if the if his pop was on target because there's no way Evo would have gotten back. So well played from uh, Evo to get the, the clear back and that shot there as well. So it's probably going to follow with the 50-50. It's probably going to be a goal too. He might have shot that too slow. He definitely should have scored that. It was definitely open. Oh, wait here for a second. Go for the late 50-50 because he turned. Evo needs to go back for the back shot. Good save. Make sure it's awkward touch for him. Make him waste his boost. Stay with us again here. Once again, I'm pretty low boost, so I gotta be a little bit careful with his touches. Nice catch from Evo too. Now I can get a few pads. I see the pad on the left here. Go for that one. Close. Pop it up nice and high. Hopefully I can return for the boost too. That's why I went for that touch to try and get the corner boost off that flip too. See if uh, Evo goes to the backboard. I'm just gonna wait for this touch from Folly. Whoa. Not the greatest touch, but I had to watch out for the demo. And with Volley clearing that, it should be a free touch from Evo off the backboard. I'm going to stay with this too. That's also a challenge. That's totally fine. No, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was going to go around the sidewall a little more, but it popped out mid. Um, a little bit, a little bit of a late flip from Evo. I tried to force that 50-50 to go into the curve, and it just didn't pop up far enough. I thought it was going to go over the left side of the net, but it ended up popping out. Uh, even though I thought I forced it into that that corner to pop it up really high, but I, I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't pop out as far as you think it should. Should be Evo's ball here. Supposed to up early. Okay, he missed. Go for the bump. Good save. Go for the 50-50 as well. That might be in. Let's go. Nice. Yeah, he left it for me in the midfield. I expected him to go back because I thought he was going to see the pinch coming. But I end up getting a free pinch here because he goes for the mid boost. And Bali jumps up early. But uh, we get a free clear. So pretty good. Right, I'm going to try and f Let's see if he can take this instead. Oh, okay. Need boost, he says. Well, I'll force it uh, into him, I guess. Nice. Whoa. There we go. Couldn't quite get the shot. This is going to be a 1v1v2 1v2 for uh, Evo now. It's not a win for this. I scared him off enough that Evo gets a free ball now. Take the boost from him. Try to get the late scoop. So Evo left that boost in the corner, which is not good because that means uh, Sosa's going to have a free boost possession. But I think Bali went way too far forward. He did. And we get another free clear. Uh, Bali was too scared to challenge, which makes sense. But he was also pushed up off the initial uh, pop. I think he maybe thought Sosa was going to get a 50-50. Ends up not getting one. It's going to be a bit of an awkward bounce here. Probably go for a immediate shot. I should not have went for the boost. But that was a little bit scary. It was almost better for me to fake that. But Bali missed the uh, the read on where I was going to clear the ball. Good pop. Try to pop it far. Evo definitely doing a lot of work here. I'm just going to wait for his touch off the cross. All right, so Bali touches it. But that actually just gives the ball right back to Evo. Oh, uh, <laughs> Frank, ah, <laughs> he's in my chat. He's in my discord. What are you doing, Frank? Frank, Hello. I'm recording. <laughs> oh, the game's over. <laughs> I'm 
I've never been jump scared so much in my life. I was sitting in a, uh, I think it was in Rapids Discord, and he scared me so much when he joined. I got plus zero for some reason. I got 1990 now. Oh my goodness. Hey, well, good news is we're almost at 2,000 MMR, which is actually probably going to be the first time this season I'll be reaching that, because I haven't actually played too much ranked this season. I'm trying to play more, and like I said, hopefully reach into the top 10, but we'll have to see how this goes, because uh, so far we've been lucky on, like, whenever I record, I definitely focus a lot more, and it's definitely a lot better, but as you can see, I do include any losses I get while I record. It's just, uh, it's been a bit of a struggle to get up this MMR, but now that we're here, I, I definitely have a better understanding of players at the highest, highest level. Um... Which is actually why I find it a little bit harder sometimes to play uh, teams of players that are like at 1700, 1800. They're all really solid and it's really hard to tell how consistent they're going to be. And sometimes they kind of surprise you. All right, Tide and Miro versus Troko and I. Troko's at 1906, so we're actually like doing pretty well compared to some pros uh, in the ranked leaderboard. It's pretty hard to get to the top top 10 right now because I know there's a lot of solid players that have been grinding super crazy and they're super high MMR. But we're going to do our best. I can't go for this. I'm just going to wait behind. Wait for his touches. So Tide's gonna have a touch here. Kind of threw it away though. I'm gonna take this boost since Troco isn't taking it. Good pass across. Smart of him to put it around me. Stay close to this. Of course, 50 50. Hopefully, Troco can get this. It's a decent fake. Could be a goal though. I'll get back fast enough here. Almost got, he gave me a free shot. I should have just went for the shot there, actually, because he definitely should have blocked that. I didn't expect him to just leave it. Nice. Pop it off the backboard. Should be a free shot from Troko, and there it is. Yeah, so they, they kind of uh, threw away their defense there a little bit. With the guy flipping there, right there, Miro, I think it was, on the floor, I knew that he couldn't reach the ball fast enough with his momentum. He'd have to slow down, and then that, in that little timing difference, it's going to allow us to go for the ball first. So I just made sure to go for it. And since he committed right afterwards, it's still, that's going to be open, actually, too. Oh, never mind. Uh, it's still open. Okay. <laughs> we might have to do another one. I don't know what's going on right now. We're just getting points after points. Um, getting pretty lucky with the the the, the uh, cues too, because Troko's really high level, and these two are both eighteen hundred. Try to go for the bump. Should be a free shot again. Uh, oh, close. And again. Wow. Yeah, we're definitely have to do another one here if this keeps going like this. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I mean, this this climb to, th to rank ten might be a lot faster than I expected. Um, I've been actually been taking a bit of a break from Rocket League because uh, a little a little burnt out as far as like competitive Rocket League goes. I still love custom stuff, obviously. It's super fun, always. That's not a good challenge for me. Oops. He threw that away a little bit too much with his. Uh, oh, it's not going. Stay close here. There we go. Good fake. Oh, did not mean to make that touch, but that's okay though. That's been interesting. Definitely like a bit of a scuff up for me. I shouldn't have uh, touched the ball so soon. Hold on, take this. Oh. Then he spent the uh, Troco to go on that. I shouldn't have popped it like that, though. Oh. This is, uh, this is a little scuffed. There we go. Works out. We got a three-goal lead super early, and now we're just kind of sitting really comfortable on it. Close. I tried to, like, really scoop that to my teammate off that follow-up. Over the one. Go for the corner boost now. Lots of space to flick it. They do get a touch, but it's probably going to be to my teammate. That is to them now again, though. Get that pretty heavy. Still probably shouldn't have went for it, though. Nice. Right, so I'll go for the boost first, because they're going to just chase it. It's around the one. Couldn't quite get to it. I try to bump him as well. Good save. Avoid the bump. Wait for, him to wait for him to touch it. Wait for him to touch it again. Don't really have too much to worry about. Except for this play here. Could be bad. It's alright. 50-50 again. Go for this before the, the opponent can. And now we get a free clear. This boost should be here in a second. There we go. It's a decent touch, but Tide's going to get that now. There we go. Miro's going to try and go for this immediately. So I'm just going to try and force it. There we go. Just leaning around the corner. If you're trying to go for this immediately, I can get the demo on him, and now we get a free touch. Just forcing his hand. We know we know all the options that he has. 
pass that down to me, maybe? Oh, so close. I tried to back off in a way that I could still recover even if it doesn't go well. And not waste all my boost. Wait for the pass across here. I was definitely open. I don't know why I didn't score. I gotta just boom that really hard. Oh. There we go. See if we can bump him. And it's just gonna roll in. <laughs> oh, no. Oh! What a save. All right, I'm gonna try and pinch this again, maybe. If he throws it away like that, it's all good. There's no one there. Troco knows that. Wait for Tide's touch. Go for the early flick. Probably grab the back corner. There's not too much, not too much of a worry of being up there. Even with Miro's touch here, it's probably gonna go to Troco. Keep this close. Force 50-50. It's a good play, but we do bump him. Oh, he's still not there. Oh no. It's gonna be a goal. Yeah, that was a good bump from uh it was Miro, I think. And I shouldn't have flicked. I was trying to pop it up for my teammate, but I realized he was actually backing off of the player who who was demoing him, so uh there wasn't really any reason for me to try and flick that, especially with low boost. I just go for a force 50-50. I could have went around the ball into a position where I can just like force it. If Miro goes for this, he's really low boost, so I don't think he's gonna do too much. He just wastes his boost here. There we go. And now we just make sure we secure that corner so we can't stay with it. Oh, I got bumped on my jump. <laughs> it's okay, though. It's going to be an awkward shot here. Okay, he missed. They both bumped each other. I'm going to fake this. Pop it around him. That shit bounced off the curve. Oh, close. We do get the win, though, and I think that's going to be probably like five points because we did have... Yeah, five points. There we go. Got a, got a pretty good feeling of how many points I'm going to get per game nowadays, but uh, let's do one more because that was pretty rough. It was both... Both GC3s for the final game here. We don't want to end with that. We got Sniper Matt on our team against Karma and Bali. Bali's been in almost every episode or every every game. I think that just the one, the last game he wasn't in. Oh, that's Miro, and I can't remember the other guy's name. I was saying Miro a lot. It's a pretty bad throw away from my teammate, but they also threw the ball away pretty hard. Should not have left that, but it's okay. Oh, probably going to go for an immediate shot here. Try to force it out for my teammate. He's pretty low boost, so be a little bit careful. Good play. Like the patience. Don't like the throw away right there, though, because they still didn't have the ball. Can't quite go for this. There we go. Good save. It's off. Hopefully my teammate stays with it. He does. Good flick. Go for the 50 50. Good challenge. Try to go for the, uh, the late flick. Yeah, okay, should be my teammate's ball now. The bounce if he's ready. What he does here. Alright, Summer Matt's kind of pushed up a little bit, so he's gonna go back. Trying to force it. Good clear. Not the greatest. It could, could have been forward more because Bali's gonna have a touch now. But they did throw the ball away now, so I get a free clear. Let's go for a high clear, see if Summer Matt wants to go for it. Gonna wait instead. Ah, not the greatest. I tried to follow it up though because Bali wasn't really covering it well. Oh my goodness. I'm not a big fan of what my teammate's doing. It's been pretty awkward because he's like not trusting me at all. But uh, it's okay. We're going to work with it. Make sure I touch this late. Make it awkward. Been a pretty weird rotation so far. Good. I was hoping my teammate would go for the follow up on the left wall. All right. At least we got some space now. There we go. I hear Bali up, but I don't want to challenge. Teammate challenging really late again. She still has it, so I gotta be a little careful with that. This could be open if I can get around to it. Nice. There we go. Pretty awkward game. Hopefully we can uh, sneak out the dub here. We got uh, two and a half minutes still to go, but it's been pretty tight back and forth. Some shots on both teams. We got some saves. Karma's holding the fort. An awkward rotation choices for my teammate as far as like what he's going for, but I'm trying to just make sure I cover uh, the worst option. This could be a goal though. Go for a late 50-50. Ah, not a great half flip. Could have been a lot faster. I don't even know how he did that. <laughs> I'm gonna wait for the late 50-50 here. It's gonna be a goal. Yeah. Um, she caught it really well off the sidewall, and my teammate was pushed up off the front post, I believe. 
Oh, uh, yeah, right there. You push up the front post. Once you see that someone has the, the wall carry, definitely want to stay back post and wait for the pass out. Uh, you kind of have to cover all the all the options you can. Hopefully my teammate can stay with this, though. Oh. This is a bit awkward, <laughs> like I said. Hopefully we can just force the ball high here. And my teammate missed. Not much I can do with that. So, uh, once again, pretty awkward game. Got two minutes to go. I think my teammate was a... F no, he just air he just air rolled really wrong. Like He, he kind of like double jumped and then flew off the ball instead of towards it. So, a bit of inexperience at this level of gameplay. It's going to plague you. Hopefully, my teammate can get there. It's pretty free. Nice. There we go. See, so I just went for the late 50-50 there to make it force mid. Because I knew that uh, Bali was going to go for the mid boost. Which means anywhere in the midfield is, is free for us. As long as Karma goes for the challenge. She does. And we get a free goal. Go for the shot if I can. Should be in. Almost. Nice. Yeah, I tried to go for the shot. I didn't quite get it as far left as I wanted to. But we're, we're really fortunate that it actually bounced off the right post. If it didn't, it would have been a free collection for them. But there, I'm just focusing on getting the really, really, really direct shot. Oh, wait for the shot here from Karma. She's got a flip reset. Nice. Good of my teammate to cover that option. Passes four of my team. He should have stayed forward there. It's definitely a clear for me. But now we're under pressure because he went back. Off that touch. Okay, I can't quite catch the wall here. Good catch, though. I mean, good 50-50. Should get the boost and go for a uh, pop. Okay, a little bit hard. I can't go for the shot now because he went really tight to the wall. Good. I like that touch because it keeps it close to the corner here. Go for the fall up wall touch. Go for the demo. Teammate should be there. That's a much better rotation being ready for that touch. Wanting him to 50-50 this or go in for the challenge. There we go. Good catch. Teammate, he's going to be there, so I'm just going to wait for the touch. Pop it forward. It could be in if it loop if it falls fast enough. Not quite. Good boost steal. I like that. Oh, he still caught it, though, so i got to be a little bit careful. New for the immediate flick. Uh, I need to go for the immediate flick there. Um, once I saw Karma turn, and then we can get a free shot. Uh, I'm just waiting for her to turn on that ball. The second she does right here, I can wait. I can bait in that quick catch and then go for the flick over. So we did. Oh, my controller. My controller. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, my God. I hate that, man. Uh, we did. I was going to say we did get out of this game uh, pretty, uh, pretty luckily, but as I do that, I... My second button doesn't click. Good by my teammate. Got some space. If she spawns the left here, it's actually a lot better for us. Should not have went for that, but it should be okay for us still. He's got some boost, but... Oh, good follow-up. Nice. Nice one. I'm surprised he had enough boost for that because he went for this, uh, this boost right here. He boosted there, and then I thought he wouldn't have enough to go for the follow-up air dribble. But it was really good for him. from him. So we cleaned it up in the last half. Luckily. But they had us in the first half. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to go for the mid boost and wait for Karma to go for the challenge. Good fake. She kind of threw it to me though. So I'm just going to shoot it for the far right. I actually probably would have been better to pop that higher. Because now they get a uh, they get a free touch. Make sure to shoot this to the left a little bit. So it goes over Karma's head in the corner. I'm going to go for the fake. Because I thought he was going to challenge. Which he does. Ended up missing the ball though. Good 50-50. Hit this down the far field, and that should be it. We got two goal lead, so well played. Go for the bump on Bali here, maybe? Oh, close. Well, it's a pretty good set of four games. We actually made it above 2K MMR, but we should have at least. Oh, uh, there we go. For the first time. And I don't know why it's 1994. It uh it's plus five and then plus four, but I promise I don't I don't cut out games. I don't care if I win or lose. It's more for your education <laughs> or just helping you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Definitely an interesting one. No losses this time around. I think the last one we had one or two losses, but uh, until next time, have a great day, guys. We'll catch you guys in the next one.